bitch on, we got bulletproof glass now. Bitch, I turned off, I feel like I want a Grammy. I'm speaking Guapanese, I know he can't understand. Hey yo, it's your boy Tommy coming to you with another Bullet Echo video and today we're going to be trying to push our trophies all the way up to 1500 hopefully by the end of the video and we're going to be using Levi in order to do so. If you guys don't already know the reason why I'm using Levi for this video is to always of course keep mixing up the heroes that I use for these trophy pushing videos. Don't expect any B class or B tier or lower heroes in these gameplay videos when we're pushing trophies. We're using all of the S and a tier heroes if you guys haven't seen my hero tier list video yet make sure you guys go ahead and check that out i posted it about a week ago here on the channel but with levi i was able to upgrade her huntress all the way up to level 13 able to maximize pretty much her hero's vision range bonus her maximum health bonus and the primary weapon bonus as well getting that double 20 percent across the board I don't have her other abilities leveled up as high, of course, you know, it's it's not easy getting batteries in this game and being a YouTuber, I use my batteries pretty much across all of my heroes, making it very difficult to max out certain ones. I've got, I think, Stalker, uh, Bastion, I've got Ghosts that are completely maxed out as far as their abilities go, but with everybody else, you're sort of lacking and falling behind. I do have enough to upgrade her Thermal right here, which would give us more piercing power, so I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. There goes the remainder of our batteries. We could get the stun up, but I don't think... I think the stun is nice, especially if you can get that passive right there with the primary weapon aiming time. But until we can get it all the way to the next one, I don't think it's going to help us too much. We'll do the... Oh, this doesn't help us out. <laughs> I guess we're just like, we'll upgrade her stun. Try to get to that next level. Try to get it up there as soon as possible. As far as her gear, I am just running the complete set of the Bionic Y. Try to get the extra bonuses where we can. It also helps her aim down our weapon a lot quicker. You know, just... She, she has a very wide weapon aiming spread, if you will. It's just so hard. Sometimes you have to slow down and pretty much stop in order to get that high damage and accuracy across the board. So the reason why I'm using her, though, is because there's a lot of people nowadays running. You guys have seen it. If you guys are playing ladder, you guys already know. There's a lot of S-tier hero ghosts and stalkers running around the map with their invis. She's a great counter to the invisibility strat. And then Bastion is a little bit tougher to deal with because... Usually with her, what I do at the very end of the game is I hide behind the wall, pop the uh, the thermal, and whoever is there is always going to die. But sometimes the Bastion can counter that by popping his shield, of course. And then if he's looking straight at you, you're sort of stuck in Storm. You can't even come out. You can't rotate around. You just sort of die there. But nonetheless, she's been doing a pretty good job for us today so far. So we're going to try our best in this video here to get us our ourselves all the way up to 1500. All right, so here we go. We've got a lot of really good stuff here in our first game. You'll love to see this. We'll get the ammo, the armor, the enhancer. If I had a charge, I would charge and just like thermal through that wall right there. But we do not have one of those. So we'll play it slow, right? Now that we're starting to get higher up in trophies, players are starting to play a little bit more slow. There are all these S tier heroes. So we can't exactly just key out and 50-50 everybody. So I've been playing a little bit smarter. Um, of course, as we got higher and higher and higher, I can't wait to do so. So we can go up against... high quality players nonetheless big fights going down on this part of the map zone sort of ends over here so I should I think I'm gonna lurk on this part of the map we might be able to get a third party kill right here maybe okay so they're not as close as I thought they were Bastion. If we can catch a Bastion early in the game like that, you always want to do that because he's one of the heroes that I have a harder time countering. I might even thermal this. Oh, yeah. There you are. I think we'll have enough time to get our thermal back by the end of the round. If not, I sort of just sold there, but I think we're good. We just have to wait for it to charge back up. Really honing in on the, the sound cues. Now I pop that and easy dub. So that's pretty much what I do with her at the very end of those games, right? You just want to hide behind the wall and use the thermal. I wasn't trying to kill him. As you guys saw, I was shooting a whole bunch of bullets there. That's just the way the game works. Sort of automatically shoots for you. I wasn't trying to get shots off. As a matter of fact, I wanted to keep that as low key as possible. 
wait for him to snipe the other opponent and they get the free kill through the wall nonetheless that actually worked out a-okay you know able to clutch up there that's the goal with levi right you don't even need to get into i mean in general in this battle it's, it's a battle royale in general you don't want to get into any fights if you don't have to because all fighting does in this game like especially if you're trying to get a win streak going so you can level up to the next tiers faster and faster all fighting does is give away your position right so you want to be able to take your time play slow and you'll be able to get win streaks going but in this game we are going to be in a little bit of trouble it looks like Please don't look, he's not paying attention. Bastion, nice! Oh my goodness, he was about to pop his ability. He didn't get it off. Okay, so the reason why I was saying we was here in trouble, we spawned sort of in the middle of the map there. That was not good at all. Um, just because with Levi, she has no finesse, right? And there are other heroes that have the envies or stim shots even move faster to get away from areas or shields to block their way. But if you sort of get caught lacking with a Levi, you just, I mean, <clears throat> that's thats it. You just die. You kind of have to fight them head to head. So here, uh, I mean, foregrip is always good. We'll get this further shield too. Only two other people left. The zone ends right there. So if I can get it to the point, that's, a, that's actually a really good zone ending for us. If we can get predict pretty much which side our opponents are going to be on of that wall. If we get on the back side of it, we win that automatically with our thermal. We got to really make sure no one pops up. Okay, so yeah, he's on the opposite side of the wall here. Let me just make sure. Okay. Let it close. Thermal. Nothing he can do. That is just the brilliance of Levi. There's legit, I mean, he's behind the wall. Especially considering he's a firefly there. There is no counter that he can do to us. To prevent that and i knew that right i heard the sniper go off i was like okay so sniper shot went off I was like, that's either i believe mirage I, I didn't think that sounded as heavy as a slayer uh, that's either gonna be a mirage or a firefly either way neither of those heroes can defend against the thermal through the wall so those sound cues and paying attention to which heroes you're going up against can help you out tremendously let's go ahead and upgrade um well, i think we go over the thermal right Oh, never mind. I thought I got something big from that. Maybe it was her stun. Yeah. To the weapon aiming time. We'll do that instead. And this is for range of allies. You don't really need that. Let's get her health up. Oh, we need one more. We need 40 more batteries to get that incoming damage. Okay. All good. I wasn't paying attention to that. Let's go ahead and hop into another game. I think we're at, how many trophies are we at right now? 1493, we're seven trophies off of hitting that 1500 mark. Super, super solid. We just can't get caught lacking early game. It might happen this video. It might happen. Those early games are so weird. If you can get yourself backed into a corner, you need to do it, especially with a Levi. You need it, you need to. She's just way too slow. Way too much of a brick. All right. Oof, that's a lot of good stuff. A little ammo, armor. We get our ability up here early too, which is lit. get the extendo four grip and a whole bunch of ammo from this pile right here bam okay so six are left i think we'll wrap back around the left side here 
could get. Let me get a make it. Just in case. Wait, I'm going down. The, wait, the left? Yeah, I think we go left. The homie is just pushing. That's Leviathan, I'm pretty sure. I'm not too worried about a Leviathan. He can't really do much. That, that, that turret can be annoying, but... He's one of the heroes that I'm not as worried about. Stalker, on the other hand. I will pop my thermal. I didn't want to have to, but... Because I don't know if we get it up now in, in time to fight Leviathan. But I didn't want him to go invis on me and take me down there. He's behind this wall. We can win this pretty easily. Yeah, he is. Nothing he can do. Once again, Levi, like, you just sit there. There is nothing they can do. Like, look at the win streak we're putting down with this hero right now. We've been able to finesse and survive in the early game. That's been proving us so and helping us out so much. Once you stay alive, you get your guns or you get your ammo, you get your weapons. And boom, you can sort of just sit there behind the wall and cheese. I'm surprised. I mean, we haven't we haven't run into a bastion yet. I think our bastions either have been dying. They have to be because there's no way people are not running bastions. I think we've killed a couple bastions actually. But in the end game, that's the only hero that can sort of foil your plans. Because then you got to go through the storm and chase him down. Usually by then you're in trouble and you'll die. But it looks like we're going on to the asylum. My favorite map. We should be able to win this game, assuming we can get alive or get off the early game here. We got ammo and armor. We're vibing. I might not even leave this corner. Early in the game, especially on the side. I, I know how to play this map really well. Early game, you just sit in your cubby. Right? Because people rotate a lot in this map. And they'll come through. You'll be able to get some free picks, some free kills. And the reason why you want to stay here is not only because you want to get some free kills. It's because you don't want to get... You don't want to get snuck up on, right? I could wasn't necessary like super necessary but thermal through the wall let our ability charge back up there she goes so we got shotgun all right that was a i think that was a, what's her name dang I'm, I'm i'm blanking out but a shotgun hero is something we like to see she just got flattened though by the AR, that could be anyone. No way, right? Let's grab the site. We'll grab this one because it's closer to zone. Boom. Oh, I kind of need this too, low key. That's worth. We were able to get it off too. Okay. Same sort of vibe here. Right, we just do this. Satoshi sitting in the corner. I mean, I don't think I lose games with this hero. I think it, I think this is the hero we try to go for the 20 win streak with in a row. Although I do want to bury it up because we just used her for this video. So we might change it up. But if you guys are looking to gain trophies easily, this is the hero of bringing us all the way up to 1,500 trophies that's going to bring us to 21,000 in the world. We're climbing our way up. I hope they somehow come up with a leaderboard to where the trophies reset, like in Clash Royale. I don't know if you guys know this, know that game, but like, cause it's impossible to sort of like an over, over, over time, or what do you call it? Overall leaderboard with the lat, like with the trophies like that. I don't really, I don't think that's ideal, but either way, those are, those are just win after win after win after win. Play as Levi. If you guys happen to be struggling in this game with gaining trophies, I'm telling you, I don't even have her max. I mean, yes, I have her ultimate, of course. So I have to keep that in mind. But at the same time, I don't have her abilities maxed out. You know, it's just the Huntress up to level 13. That's level 8. That's level 7, level 5. So if I max her abilities out and if I can get, you know, a couple more of these gears to get up to the higher levels, I think that she's going to be a huge force to be reckoned with. But either way, hope you guys enjoyed today's video and hope you go on and enjoy the rest of your day.